Hey guys, how's it going? My name is Masamitsu. Today I'm going to share with you how to make a folding table. Let's get started. Starting a rough cut. I used maple and cherry and walnut for the tabletop, making one edge nice and straight. Glue them up into two balls. And clean up with planer. Resawing these boards, I don't have banzo. So I used a Japanese rip cut hanzo. So much exotic. Clean up with planer again. So much satisfied. These thick veneer needed divide at 30 degrees. The veneer is bended so away from the trimming jig. Painter tape method is very useful with CA glue and activator. The tabletop needs exact same angle, each veneer and sharp edge. Repeat the process. Line up these balls for checking the pattern. Glue them up on 9mm Japanese birch plywood. I use the Japanese Piton vacuum bag for air press clamping. In just case, adding the mechanical clamps.
it have bended because the thin plywood and one side became high humid from glue. Apply some water to the bottom side of the tabletop. Let water dry with clamping. Still bend it. I gave up. Mm. Trimming the top layer. Fixing is unwilling process, but one of the most fun it. Making grooves on top layer and some lumber. The lumber's groove just a little bit away from the fence than top layer's one. Making a little bit bigger bottom panel with quarter inch plywood. The tabletop has sandwich structure. That main purpose is reducing weight. Making a sandwich with tight bond butter. I hope a little bit straighten the bend the top layer. Legs are waiting. Making mortises on legs.
making tenants. Too tight. After some pepper, I got my feet. Round tenon is easy to make for lazy me. Adding a recess on the stretcher, making square up with chisel. It works as a stopper portion. Plus train bit is easy to make clean surface. It made exact perfect same size to the top layer. Making double holes to attach wooden hinges for legs. I trimmed with walnut. Making taper legs, I like it. Mark where the legs interferes to the tabletop. Cut off the interfere portions. <laughs> Test assembly. It worked.
I made a mistake. Legs had interference between topper and leg stretcher, so I shaved off that portion. This structure made legs wobbling, so much disappointed. So adding a simple brace bar to connect legs. This brace bar is so much effective against the wobbling. Secure hinges. Don't apply glue for leg area. Center of the tabletop is high spot and the same height to the trim. Both end of the tabletop is low spot. I try to flatten with number 4 hand plane. It needs fresh sharpened blade because of the tabletop has complex wood grain. Carefully start and gently smoothing. After flattening, I took a little bit sanding and chamfering. I had sanding all edges and surfaces for more comfortable use.
Thanks for watching. I hope you guys enjoy this video. Please consider hit the like button and subscribe. I'll see you in the next video. See ya!